Wow, weather is so nice today. Oh my God, what is that colorful thing in the sky? It looks so beautiful. Hi, Tim. May I help you? Who are you? You look so beautiful and colorful. <laughs> Thank you, Tim. I am your friend, Angel. You wanted to know about the colorful, beautiful thing in the sky, right? Yes, you are right. Okay, I'm going to explain this to you. Wow, that's so exciting! This is a rainbow. Do you know what is a rainbow? Oh no, I don't know. Can you tell me what a rainbow is? It's a curved line of different colors that sometimes appears in the sky when the sun shines through rain. Hmm. Now, what are you thinking, Tim? I was thinking about how a rainbow is formed. Rainbows occur when light and water combine in a very specific way. When a beam of sunlight comes down to Earth, the light is white. This white light contains all the colors of a rainbow, and these colors will separate if the light beam happens to hit raindrops on the way down at a particular angle. The angle for each color of a rainbow is different, because the colors slow down at different speeds when they enter the raindrop. The light exits the raindrop in one color, depending on the angle it came in. So we only see one color coming from each raindrop. Light at different angles coming through many raindrops form the rainbow that we see in stripes of red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, and violet. Oh, it's so interesting. But there are so many colors in the rainbow, I'll forget the names. Let me simplify this for you. Just remember this mnemonic. Richard of York gave battle in vain. Red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, and violet. Thank you for making this easy for me. You are welcome, Tim. I've one question. Why is a rainbow always in an arc? Well, Rainbows form a complete circle. However, only half is visible. The horizon only allows us to see half of the rainbow circle, so we just see an arch. What causes the rainbow to have a circular formation is the way that rain droplets fall. The rain droplets do not fall in a flat sheet. However, they tend to fall at various distances and speeds. On some occasions, you can see a full circle around a garden hose. Wow, that's so exciting! Tell me one thing, why can't I find the end of the rainbow? Isn't it ending at some place? A rainbow is an optical illusion, so you just can't catch up to it. When you move, so does it. It's great! Now I understand all about a rainbow. It's so easy to finish the assignment my class teacher has given me. Thanks again. You're welcome, Tim. Now go home. It's getting late. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.